Good morning guys, welcome back to, oh my gosh, to another week in my life vlog. Got back from Cabo in Chicago yesterday. I cleaned my house, I organized, I put my laundry away, I did all that stuff, and now we are back in action. I am so happy to be home because I reunited with my favorite best coffee ever. I've never been the girl who's like, it's better at home, but it's better at home with this creamer. I know I've talked about it. Literally non-stop. I don't even know if it's to shake this. Whatever. Um, but it's this cookie butter creamer in case you guys are wondering. It's so good. Nothing like it. Cabo was so fun. I hope you guys enjoyed that vlog. I leave and I go to New York for 48 hours next week just for a quick like trip because I'm doing something with Macy's. But then after that, I am home all month besides like I think we're going to Fort Worth, but like that doesn't really count, you know? So anyways, I'm getting a little bit back into my routine, but I'm going to work out and do my normal stuff. But like the vlog when I get back like two weeks or whatever, it's going to be the most insane, like getting back into routine, hot, like healthy grocery shop. I mean, I am grocery shopping, so, but like the whole thing, it's going to be one of those like productive routines. You guys are going to like just love it. Okay. Like just know it. I do want to tell you that, look at Fitz right now. He is my live audience. I love you. I love you. I mean, he's so sweet. I'm Fiona and Coco. Um, we are officially two weeks out of surgery today. She's not walking. She was with my dad and my dad, I mean, oh my God, his life has been Coco, but like you're supposed to have her in the crate. Like she's supposed to be, which he wasn't doing anything bad. Like she was like laying with him. Um, she was supposed to be like crate resting basically and then doing like two walks a day that are like five minutes long and then I do like these massages and stuff. Anyways, she still isn't walking. Some dogs can walk days after, some dogs can walk months after. I did notice this morning, I do think she's a little bit stronger in her back legs. And then I've heard that like, it's a very rapid recovery once they start being able to walk. So I don't know, she has an appointment, a little checkup on Friday and I'm gonna talk to them then. Everyone keeps sending her good vibes. Some people it literally, or some dogs it took literally months, so. I have a taking ritual. I actually just got a new bottle. They reached out and I'm like, I've literally already taken this. Like I didn't even need them to send me one because I'm like, I am a paying subscriber. It's been like such a solid in my routine. I always keep it like right where I keep my like coffee mugs in the morning because that's when I like grab for it every single day. Ritual offers science backed wellness designed to support you through all stages of life. Ritual has a great new symbiotic to support gut health. And this multivitamin is just to fill in the gaps in our diet. Like it doesn't matter like what you eat. You can never get like everything. And I feel at least I can't. And they also have like the prenatal, postnatal. Like they just have a lot of really good trust me products. I'm like shaking this. I don't think I should be doing that. I love the convenience of Ritual. It is delivered to my door every single month. I like that they have the nine like key nutrients and just two daily capsules. It's so easy to take, but it's helping like, again fill gaps in your like diet. Also, my favorite thing for y'all is that they have a happiness guarantee. So if you don't like it after you've been using it for 30 days, you can return it, full refund, no questions asked. What is also cool about Ritual is you can take it on an empty stomach. It's very gentle on your stomach. Sometimes if I take vitamins or something on an empty stomach, I'm so sick after. And I just find that I'm more um, like consistent if I can just take it like whenever. It's gentle on the stomach so you can take it with or without food. It's also like so easy to throw into your routine. So if you guys want to start a daily ritual with Ritual, head on over to ritual.com slash 20 and you guys can get 20% off your first month. Thank you to Ritual for sponsoring today's video. They're sponsoring, but I am already a paying customer. It is so easy, makes me feel so much better. And also like, it's just such an easy thing to add to your routine. Cannot recommend enough. Ritual.com slash 20 and if you guys don't like it, you can return it for a full refund, no questions asked. So anyways, very fabulous, love this. I've got a call. Oh, I'm gonna leave pretty soon. But weightlifting, of course. <laughs> Guys, I have been wearing, like, because I, first off, my closet gets installed next week. So I've had like 10 of my workout sets out and not like the rest of so many workout sets. Um, and I've just been going back to my outdoor voices. I think these are the seamless collection ones. Like, I wear them literally nonstop. Um, but, gotta call some friends for our little morning gossip sesh, if you will. 
Um, today, everyone is... Oh, today we're doing the Okan shoot here. So we're doing hair and makeup here and then we're setting up a backdrop, which is actually so convenient because like you can't forget something. You know what I mean? And then it's less lugging and like whatever. Um, and also it's really nice because I don't really like leaving Coco more than I like a workout or something right now. So I need to get my nails done this week for eras. Like what do I do? Oh, also guys look at my forehead. It's peeling. Like that's not like tanner coming off. That's like my skin is peeling off. You know, it's not like a bad self tan job. It's, um, my skin is feeling really bad. I'm back from the workout and I have this like little nightgown thing on. This is from their free people, like Daisy Jones and the Six collab. They sent like the cool, actually I'll go show you guys right now. They sent the coolest package. I got it yesterday when I got home and I was like, this is amazing. So it came in this guitar case that I believe from uh, yeah the golden canvas i don't know if they do this on everything but pretty cool very cute actually and then look at this there was gifting all in here and look at how cute everything is it's like so this is such a good like brand collab this belt i love um and then just like jewelry all of this stuff these little hair accessories obviously like very daisy jones this bag is so cute um, yeah, everything's adorable. These sunglasses, like just such a good collab. This is still looking stunning. Everyone commented on my TikTok to switch the chairs and stuff, which I haven't done yet. I haven't even, I didn't even put this there. Like CB2 does it right into wherever they want it to go. So I'm cleaning up a little bit. I need to do the dishes, make some breakfast. Um, also Method sent this. Unfortunately, it like got dented in the um, shipping. So anyways, I need to clean this off, and then it's like a reusable gel hand wash. Looks a lot better than the Myers one that's sitting there, even though I love Myers. Been really back on my avocado toast and I've been adding honey and it tastes amazing also we're shooting the beige bag today also a little bit of the pink and a few other things that we're releasing just to have the beige bag by the time you all see this vlog I believe it's available so shop it is the best bag like I'm not just saying that obviously because it's my brand but let me just show you, okay? Quality is unbelievable. It's just so beautiful. It kind of, it's a big bag. It fits a lot, but well, you can really tell here. It's just the perfect everyday bag. It's also amazing if you're like working at a coffee shop or like going to Pilates or going to work out or whatever. Like this is just like the catch all everyday bag and it fits so many things. There's two pockets, there's a zipper pocket and then there's just like so much stuff my bag's really unorganized right now because i just got back from traveling obviously but oh and there's a zipper at the top it's literally the best under a hundred dollars it's a bag you'll use literally non-stop and there's a like magnetic clasp right here so if you want it to like feel smaller you can do it but it's just stunning i am obsessed um and you guys can get it now it's a perfect bag for summer anyways i'm gonna eat my breakfast um, and clean a little bit more. Everyone's arriving, makeup's arriving in like an hour, and I'm just gonna, I'm gonna ask Jess to do makeup first, and then I'm gonna like continue to get work done. I have a whole TikTok list and a shot list, because I do like more of the creative stuff. Um, so the shoots are like my, where I arrive. Jessica, Isabel Kristen's here. It's makeup time. <laughs> Jessica's about to try the infamous coffee. Thank you. I swear to God, if you don't like this. <laughs> If you don't like this, like honestly, just lie to me. Okay, what flavor is it? Just drink it first. Oh, it's good. Okay. It's good. Tastes like cinnamon. Are you being honest? Or are you just doing? Mm -hmm. It's amazing, isn't it? It's not amazing. Oh my god! You're <laughs> it's the only. It's really good. It's really good. I like it a lot. I probably would just rather drink a whole milk cappuccino. Mm, see, I don't like cappuccinos. Um, it's the Calipia Farms cookie butter creamer, but it's not. That, it tastes like cinnamony. Yeah, and it, I feel like that's not a good. It's brick. not too sweet. I yes, like exactly. That's why I didn't want to tell you what it was, and then you say that it would be, you know, it's really good. <laughs> Wow. Mm -hmm. 
beautiful salads. Okay. okay guys, I finished the shoot. We just did like content for the beige bag and our, okay. And our website photos. And then we also did TikTok and a few like G7X pics. Um, but I actually need to get a lot of work done and my schedule just keeps getting crazier. I, great news, great actually. I kind of think I'm being punked because we got an email from Tarte today asking me to come to Taylor Swift in a suite on Sunday. And I have tickets for Saturday and I wanted to go Sunday anyways. I'm having like my family over on Sunday, um, but I wanted to go to Taylor Swift regardless on Sunday. So now I'm like, is this real or am I being punked? You know what I mean? Because it's Taylor Swift era tour, era's tour in a suite. So you tell me. I was gonna come tonight, but now I, I don't know. I ate like a really late lunch. So we'll see how that goes. Um, my makeup looks so fabulous. Kristen Farah, my favorite makeup artist ever in Dallas did it. My I, this is not any outfit that I was wearing, but like honestly, I think I'm gonna be wearing actual like crop tops, skirts, and boots all summer long. I wanna get the Annie like brown boots. I'll put them on the screen from Tacova's because they're pointed toe and I need pointed toe because I only have like brown square and I wear these all the time. But like I wear these writing. So I feel like I need another pair. And I, um, my house was beeping like all day, like this, the alarms were going off. And I just like, do not do well with like noises. Like I'm a really, it, it takes a lot to irritate me. Like I grew up with so many siblings. Like I don't really get annoyed easily, but like noises, oh my God. Like if I hear someone chewing, I literally, I'm gonna murder. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, something bad is gonna happen. Um, anyways, I'm like house beeping and it was so loud. And it's like the one thing that like, sets me off like I don't know what it is about noises like I can't do it like it, I'm like oh my god it's not good I just tried out one of Katie Austin's recipes on her Instagram. It's like a healthy bolognese stuffed zucchini. I'm watching some podcasts right now and then I'm gonna get in bed and read my book. And then I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. It is Tuesday morning. My hair is crazy because my scalp is peeling on my hairline and it looks like something else. I need an eye stroll too, but I woke up. I went on a nice walk with Fitz. I'm getting a little bit of work done. Actually, now I'm working on my summer presentation. So tonight, I'm hosting, um, we're doing a little like girls dinner, breakfast for dinner themed. We're all wearing pajamas. I just like a Walmart deal before. Um, and I decided that it's the perfect time to get ahead of summer plans. And I made a summer deck of all of our plans. I made us a mood board. And then of like all of our things that we want to do this summer, I went as far as Fort Worth plans. I gave us lake week, I gave us lake week, lake weekend options for dates. Just throwing some dates out there. Hard to plan a lake weekend, you know what I mean? Um, activities, lots of Fort Worth, lots more dinner parties, summer concert light up. I mean, I got really, you know, whatever. And I'm going to add um, our best friend for the summer, which is going to be the G7X with Flash because you guys know after the Cabo vlogs how much that camera just means to us to get all the girlies onto it. So we all know we just all need to be on the same page. I'll vlog my presentation tonight. You guys will see. It's very important to me. Um, it's very, very important that this happens. So anyways, um, I'm going really soon. I'm leaving in like five minutes to a Taylor Swift themed hot pilates class it's like taylor swift versus rivals i wanted to get one on tuesday but i had just gotten back and i just like didn't want to leave the dogs again and like i really needed to like clean and like get my life together so um i didn't go but they have another one at the walnut hill location which is actually my favorite of the pilates locations even though uptown is newer you guys don't care about this like why am i telling you this anyways um yeah, I'm just giving some examples. I mean, I'm like really going all out, but like I'm the one who makes plans in the friend group. Like I'm planner. So if not me, then who? You know what I mean? I just got home and I'm not going to have water for a couple hours and I'm disgusting. So my plans today are a little bit off, but I got home to, where's my sheet? Where did I put that? 
it's a package from Tarte. See you at Taylor Swift. Like, literally the best surprise. I really wonder who dropped out last minute and they gave me the ticket, but hey, I'm not complaining, okay? This, I'm going to do a little haul, but I feel so gross. Okay, let's see. They gave me all of this stuff. I'm so excited. All right, guys. I used to use this setting spray all the time. This is all I wanted when I was younger. Oh, my God. Wow. Smooth operator finishing powder. Oh, I'm excited. The Amazonian clay. This is a primer. Is it an eye primer? Looks so cute. I love anything of their, like, maracuja juicy lip stuff. What's this? Lash primer. Okay, you know what? The only time I've used a lash primer was from Tarte, and it made my mascara look so much better. I need to go back to that. I was tubing mascara, and then a bunch of other products to try. <sighs> I'm so excited. <laughs> Later this evening, I got a lot of work done, and then I also made those arrangements. As you guys saw, I'll show you my beautiful stunning one. I also set up a little tablescape for dinner tonight. I mean, it's looking so beautiful and so perfect. I mean, this one is like nothing crazy because I don't really have that many flowers, but I kind of like a like random messy look. I finally built this wine rack that I've been meaning to for weeks. So finally, I have all my food out, like where I'm gonna cook it, life hack. When you're having people over, these are going in the toaster, those are going in the oven, those are being air fried, those are going on the stove. Um, but I have so much wine just out on the counter that I've been meaning to put away. I'm also watching School of Rock. I haven't seen this in so long. It's a pajama breakfast themed dinner party, so I need to change into pajamas. I decided to do all pink skims. These are like my favorite pajama sets to use in every day. I will link below. I also have the tank top on and then I just unbuttoned the top just to like add a little something to the look, but I think it's really cute. All right guys, I have my coastal grandmother playlist going on. Setting up, Macy has arrived. She's come early. Um, we're making chicken and waffles tonight. I have hash browns. We have the pancake and sausage corn dog things. These are the best things ever. In the oven, um, and I have one more thing. What am I making? Oh yeah, turkey bacon. Everyone, I didn't realize how big of a hit turkey bacon was until the group chat. Yeah, same. How do you feel about turkey bacon? About, uh, okay, so Kenzie was like, send your favorite breakfast items. And oh. I said, an egg white omelet. Because <laughs> that's just so, I, I don't eat egg white omelet. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it looks like it, it. It's like really healthy and like not what we want for no. this. No, no, but no. I requested chicken and waffles and we got it. Yeah, so. we did, it was your wrap. Yeah. yeah. Oh, we just wrap. That's it. Of course. Here's our cute little setup. It's very simple because those have to be toasted. The rest is happening there. Oh, I need my syrup still. BRB. Okay guys, we're getting ready for my presentation. Macy help me because I don't know how to use. Yeah, she's IT here. It looks kind of stunning. I should reuse that. Guys, Macy's, we just finished our dinner party and Macy's trying, you like, you know what you look like, Miranda <laughs> sings. <laughs> Macy's trying out our red lipstick and messed it up for Eras. <laughs> it would look cute if you like, 
have it all over your teeth. <laughs> Guys, Macy and I are having a sleepover because we're going to the same workout class in the morning anyways. Oh, I don't know what I just said there. Um, I feel like my presentation went really well. I feel good about that. I was logged out of my app for Fit Social. Oh, really? We're just gonna go together. We have to go in the morning. Um, what time should we leave then if we have to stop your place? Well, I left my car. Oh. So I can just leave a little earlier. Got it. Like 7.45? Yeah. So I guess we'll separate for a couple minutes. But then after that, don't worry, we'll be back together. Oh, I'm right next to you. Are you at four? Oh, two. Oh. Good. I will have to look at I just thought it was stupid to go home when I'm yeah. here. Oh, was it? Wednesday's workout easy? Yeah, it was actually really easy. And I was thinking about it during it. And like, even during that, I was just like, I was just in the mood of like, I'm just here so I don't find. Like, I was just like, okay. Yeah, when you're mentally not in a workout, it's just like. So I was just like going through the motions. I was like, I could have made it harder and I just didn't. I was thinking about that and I was like, sometimes it's just. Yeah, I'm not even sore from it, really. Maybe we're just too strong. But I don't want Erin to know that because like sometimes we do need easy workouts and if she thinks it's easy then we're gonna die. Oh I know. So ow! I My arm no, it's hurt. It's gonna be hard, I can feel it. Good morning guys, I'm ice rolling right now and Fitz is just sitting and staring at me like this. Went to bed at midnight, that's so late for me on a school night. Good morning from us, the fit girls, the healthy girls, the productive girls. Miranda sings left, Macy is back. <laughs> I need to tell them about the workout set. Oh I yeah. Like, Mom. I have two of these for the record. I was going to record. leave and go home to change and she was like, wait, what size are you? And I was like, medium. And she gave me one, so. Cute. This is my workout set. This so is Tabletics. It's the power hold. Power hold. They're you really good. Badletics.com slash I love you. So you can use code fabletics.com slash I love you and get some It's such a long thing. It's like 30% off your first VIP so member month. over and borrow her clothes if I recite the talk you <laughs> Macy yeah. or Miranda Sings, I think. So I think we have some options for you. We're looking for red lipstick. I saw one at the bottom. When I, I was, had her ask, um... Yeah, I just texted TK, but it's like 5 a.m. there. T search up TikTok, like well, TK red lip. Well, no, I looked at Taylor King red lip and um, it's all Taylor Swift. <laughs> Oh. Are you gonna do red lip this weekend? No. So I can borrow? Yeah. Should I, should I practice see. right now? You do not like Miranda Sings. No offense, Miranda Sings. She knows what she does. <laughs> okay. Can you tart, 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 Hey Tart, I'm also free. No, I'm actually going. She's actually not. Okay. Picture this with a full face of makeup, high power. Coco. Coco. Mom has to make money. Okay. <laughs> Power pony, anglet earrings, white dress, bling boots. All right, guys. So, update. Did my workout. Took Coco to her two week checkup appointment. She obviously still isn't walking, and they're like, don't lose hope yet. Like, sometimes it takes four months, you know? Um, and they did, and I thought, I'm, I don't know if I'm looking crazy, if there's very slight progress. Um, and then they said they also saw it and we're gonna start going to physical therapy The fact that my dog is going to physical therapy is actually crazy and of course it's Coco. Of course it is, you know Ironically, she's my low-maintenance dog before this um, Because Fitz is very sensitive and he's just like a very emotional dog Coco just is very easy adaptable whatever, but obviously IVDD has her down. So anyways everyone please Keep Coco in your thoughts and prayers. We're practicing lucky girl syndrome. She's gonna be able to walk and make a full recovery and it's gonna happen sooner rather than later. Her full recovery from the surgery is technically six weeks. We have like another month. Um, and sometimes it still just take, takes longer after that. But it's not gonna take longer. She's gonna be walking soon. Everyone manifest this with me, okay? Anyways, I have like a whole maintenance day and I have so much to do so it's stressing me out and I canceled my plans tonight, and Macy's just gonna come over and we're gonna watch Reputation and like get worked on our laptops and stuff, but, um, yeah, I am getting my nails done, and then I'm getting a blowout, and then I'm getting a spray tan. And you have to time these perfectly, girls know, it's really annoying, and I need to stop at Tacova's because I need to get a pair of the Annie boots in brown. Those are gonna be my summer boots because I wear brown boots all the time, the Miranda Lambert ones, what? but they're square-toed. I personally love square-toed, but those are gonna be like my boots for the ranch and the farm, and the Annie will be like, just like boots that I wear. 
Um, I'm grabbing a snack at Starbucks. I've been really, um, I, my day is timed very uh, close together. I'm just wearing this like cute little like beige set and like Prada slides and then of course, my beige puff bag. All right guys, I just got a fabulous blowout at Dry Bar. The key to a good blowout is knowing what you want and showing reference photos and they don't ever like perfect it perfectly. Sometimes they like really mess it up, um, but it does help. And you just, I don't know. It looks so much better than if I were to do it. I have a spray tan in like less than an hour. I'm gonna run over to Jacoba's and get the boots really quick, even though- Later, I've tanned, I'm back home. It's like 7 p.m. I've spent my afternoon editing and just sending over like random stuff, sending in podcast episodes, all that stuff. By the way, my episode um, on mood came out today and I hate listening to myself. I don't like listening to podcasts. I should listen to my own more. A constructive criticism way, but I feel like I just rip myself apart. So I don't. Um, but I listened to my to our episode on mood and it's so funny. And I like just say some things that I probably shouldn't have that are like really funny, anyways. I feel like I'm like not censoring myself as much. By censoring, I mean like I'm just I don't mean like censoring in like a way that like things are like offensive. I mean like censoring in a way of like I'm like, ah, oh, I should probably hit it to myself. You know what I mean? Like, sometimes I just gotta say it. I think Theo Vaughn's inspiring me. Anyways, I ordered some spritz to have for the weekend for getting ready for Taylor Swift. I'm gonna heat up some of this bolognese. I made this the other night. Um, it's really good. It's just like a turkey, ground turkey bolognese. It's onions, carrots, ground turkey, Rayo's marinara, and then I did put like a little bit of ricotta in, but that's like optional. Um, it tastes the same as normal bolognese, and it's healthier for you, I think. So I'm gonna just like make some pasta and do this. I'm gonna watch, continue to watch my podcasts and stuff. I was supposed to go to dinner and out tonight, but like two days of concerts and then I have a pop up and then I leave for New York. I'm gonna be so tired. Like I need to say it. And my family's coming over and we're doing my brother's birthday here Sunday. So uh, that's gonna be a no. I also recorded my first podcast episode or podcast like intro and ads and stuff here. Um, and I set it up and then I went online and I ordered a bunch of other equipment because I want my podcast like the visuals to be the best ever. By the way, if y'all are listening, you can go watch or watching, you can go watch the podcast. Um, so I'm just like setting that up and I have a special guest who's actually flying to Dallas to come be on it. Oh, also, um, I plan my next dinner party, which is like not this week, but the next week it's going to be Coastal Cowgirl. And I got this like thing online that I'll share with you guys when I'm vlogging it. And I'm so excited. I'm like really getting back into my hosting era this summer. And I have this entire like closet off the garage that I just want to fill with like so many things like hosting things, like just like different tabletop and different whatever. Cause I finally have this space and I've just been wanting that for so long. So finally, and then once I actually have my furniture outside, which hopefully will be in May, that will be awesome. Um, but for now, I guess we'll just do it inside, even though for Coastal Cut it would be cool to be outside. But you know, what are you gonna do? Anyways, I'm gonna make some dinner. Guys, Macy and I are hanging out with just Coco. She's snoring on me. She has a cone on now because she has to have cream on her butt. So, Macy and I are fighting right now over what TikTok of hers made me follow her. It wasn't that one. It was before. It was like before the Disney ones. You were outside. So people ask how we met, but we don't know. Well, we do. <laughs> <laughs> But I remember like when I knew you existed, you know, you existed. like I remember like my first time like seeing something because I was like, oh, she goes to YouTube, she goes to TCU and has a YouTube channel. I'll show you the first one I went to honor liked. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> what was it? Well, it's because I, you stand out when you like something because you're all cats. Yeah. Yeah. It was me. That and I'm. And you're famous. And that's and not what the route. Kenzie Elizabeth celebrity. <laughs> <laughs> that's not the route that I was going. I was just gonna say I'm really cool and like a great person. Okay, but... wait, um, no, it was like it was like I just failed a test that I studied all weekend on. I didn't fail. I got a seventy percent. Okay, never mind. Just ignore me. I wish I could find it because I remember I'm just laughing. Really, I'm just really well known. I remember like telling a friend. That was like, oh my god, this girl's so funny. And then Lauren sent me your TikTok like the first week that we were gonna hang out. I was like, oh my god, we like literally have plans this week. That's so funny. Isn't that funny? And she's like, oh, she looks funny. And then Lauren's like, wait, another funny friend. I don't know if this will work. And then <laughs> now everyone is besties. 
Happy Taylor Swift Day! So, as you can see, I was steaming my dress. I haven't even tried this on. It's from Reformation. I was influenced by Brooke because she looks so stunning in the dress. So I had to order it and then I was like, wait, I'll just like wear it to Taylor. I know it's not like what everyone else is wearing to Taylor. And like, I'll do like more like glittery, glittery tomorrow. But I'm not like a glittery girl. Like, this is more me, you know? Like, maybe this is more like fearless. Maybe it's more like Taylor Swift, okay? Um, and then I got a new pair of Tacovas, the Annie boots that I tried to get yesterday and they were out of my size. Um, these are the Annie boot and Sequoia. If y'all, can you tell my favorite color is chocolate brown? If y'all, um, are looking to get like your first pair of cowboy boots or just like a pair of like your classic staple pair, Tacovas Annie boots because they're the best price for boots, like for good quality boots. They're obviously like pricey, but they're not pricey in comparison to boots boots can get so expensive and even like a cheaper brand is only like sometimes like a hundred dollars cheaper than these definitely worth it i will link them below i can do an entire cowboy boot collection probably on tiktok um and then i size down a half size i'm normally an eight i got a seven and a half so anyways this is supposed to be my outfit tonight i think it's only clear bags my bag's not gonna be cute it's 2 p.m i'm gonna start getting ready and just finished my makeup i recorded a get ready with me on tiktok um, I've been doing so many TikToks this week that it's been hard for me to vlog because I feel like I'm filming the same thing. Makeup is nothing crazy, really simple. My sister was going to do it and she just couldn't today. And she's really good at makeup. So now I'm like, sucks. Um, it's fine. To, I can't zip this dress up. I got a size six and I'm a size six. I don't know if my bra is like too big or what, but it's going to be like the end. I think I'll be able to zip it when my sister gets here soon. But my bra is kind of peeking out, so I'm like, should I change the bra? But like, it's kind of covering, I don't know. I will say, this is the most flattering dress I have ever put on my body. Like, I want it in black and white. In fact, I want every color that they sell, because it's so good. Anyways, my sister requested a shot when she arrives. So I'm going to chill some tequila for her, but I don't even know where all of my, oh, here it is. Guys, the, let me show you. The amount of liquor that I have is ridiculous, and not because I drink, whoa. Not because I drink all this, but because I host. And so when you host, everyone just, like, brings alcohol to, like, be polite. Um, but the issue is that I, like, really don't drink liquor at my house. Like, very rarely. Um, or I definitely don't drink enough. So, anyways, I don't even have cross tomatoes. So she's gonna... She's definitely gonna be about that. Made it to the stadium. Woo! We need to recap Taylor Swift. I didn't vlog that much last night, but I'll vlog more tonight because I'm going with a bunch of influencers. We had the best time, and I, we are literally God's favorites because our um, songs, our like surprise songs, were Death by a Thousand Cuts and Clean. Clean is like one of my favorite songs literally ever, like if not ever. I was just so happy. Obviously, the show is amazing. Taylor Swift is the best performer ever. My, I'm like the luckiest girl ever because my uncle's in radio. So growing up, I got to go to like so many shows. Like if you guys have gone to a live show, this somehow comes up in every single live show. When I was younger, um, I was, I don't know, we were living in Frisco, Texas at the time still. So I would have been like first grade, I think. Anyways, it's Alyssa and Austin's dad. We were at the Jingle Ball concert because we were for Kiss FM. This is like Kid Craddock days if y'all are Texas or Dallas people. Or like, I guess it's like, and that's like nationally syndicated, I think. Anyways. Um, oh, also this Jenny Kane candle is amazing. And they just reached out to work for me on the podcast. And I'm like, you have no idea how perfect of timing this is because I'm literally your biggest fan. Anyways, um, I had gotten an autograph from Justin from American Idol. Curly hair Justin. Like, I forget his last name. Um, and then I lost it and I was like crying. We were like backstage, like back 
Yeah, I guess we were backstage is like what you would say, but like not really, whatever. We were like back there, you know? And then I was walking and I was crying because my autograph flew away and who stopped me other than Beyonce? Beyonce stopped me and I was wearing a like children's place, like quilted coat, you know, with the fur on it. And she complimented my outfit and I swear to God, that's the day kids yelled at was born. Anyways, I don't even know how I got to that point, how I got to that story. Oh, my point is, I've seen so many shows live, and yes, obviously, like, I am a huge Taylor Swift fan, like, she is, she's been my childhood, she's, I've always been, like, a Swifty, like, I've never missed a tour, I just am, like, I love her, um, I swear I'm not just saying this from a way of, like, I'm biased, but she puts on the best show you'll ever see in your life, like, she is, like, a once-in-a-lifetime entertainer, performer, like, the shows are just so good, so if you guys haven't gone... Which I'm sure, like, I'm saying this as if it's, like, news. Like, obviously, this is not news. Everyone knows this. But it was just amazing. So, anyways, then I got so lucky. I really wanted to find tickets for tonight regardless. And Tart reached out. So, I'm going with them tonight. Um, right now, I am getting ready because I'm hosting my little brother's, like, birthday family celebration at my house. So, I'm about to make a cheese board. And then my bacon wrap dates are so good. Um, and then I'll probably vlog again when I'm getting ready for the concert once everyone leaves. Um, but yeah, it's Sophie's first time to come see my new house. It's actually pretty much everyone's first time to see the house. So I'm excited. Also, these avocados are kind of trash. This is a true sign of maturity. I hosted my entire family. Um, so the house is a little bit disoriented currently, but it's a little cluttered. Like this needs to be fixed. But we did finally hand this up. Anyways, this is a sign of maturity because they left 10 minutes ago and I just cleaned my entire kitchen so quickly. I need to be ready in an hour for Taylor Swift. My niece, Sophie, guys, my, meat and my lips are really chopped and I am so tired. So I'm making my like third coffee of the day. But Sophie like did my makeup, but she like did eyeshadow and blush and foundation. And like she's seven and like, it's not bad. I'm, I'm, okay, so I'm gonna make some coffee. I don't know if I said this in a vlog yet, but I'm really into Drake Milligan's like album, his last one. I haven't listened to the rest. All right, guys, it is like storming out now, but I ordered this just as like my era's outfit. There was like a matching set. I was like wanting to make it a little more casual from Princess Polly. And like I, like I said before, I'm not like I don't love like sequins that much. Like I'm like picky with this stuff, right? I love this fit. You can't even really. Let me move you guys down really quick so maybe you can get like a better view. Like. So cute. I will link this just in case any of y'all want this for airs or just in general. I'm wearing this denim jacket, which like doesn't go, but like it's kind of like the vibe, you know what I mean? And it's easy, just whatever, just to have. Like I don't love the shades together like really at all, but this like, you know what I mean? Like whatever. And then I have this Taylor Swift era's bag that Tarte sent. And I actually think I saw people, oh, what happened? I saw people commenting on my TikTok that it's from like an Etsy store. I just like assumed that Tarte had these made for some reason. So if I find it, I'll link it because it's really cute and I want to give it away to someone on TikTok. So if you guys, maybe the giveaway is still going. I'm not sure when the swag goes up, but anyways, this is my look. Macy is going to drive with me. Oh my God, ow. Is riding with me. Oh my God, I can't talk. Um, so they're almost here and then we're all riding together so we don't have to ride alone and I have an uber voucher um, Makeup is like whatever. I've got to figure out how to like do false eyelashes Guys we've made it I'm so excited um, I'm going in to my suite. So they have floor seats this time. Yeah. So honestly, we're I'm all living large <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I have to like zoom yeah. in from my suite, you know <laughs>
Okay guys, I'm back from Eras. It is officially over for me, supposedly. I mean, like I just have a feeling that maybe I'll somehow go to another show, you know? It was so good, I'm so tired. It is currently 12.22 p.m. on a Sunday night, way past my time. I wake up early because my closet is arriving in the morning. Anyways, I wanted to give y'all a little tart haul. The tart suite was just so much fun. I hung up Bria the entire time and we just had the best time. And then I got all of these like really great lip oils. Well, not lip oils, like liquid lips. Maracuja, am I saying that wrong? Probably. Like so many different colors. Also the glow tape, which I'm really excited. So this is the highlighter. Oh, they're all highlighters. Obviously glow tape. Um, exciting. I'll be trying these out in another vlog. Um, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I know it's been a pretty probably long vlog. Again, thank you to Ritual for sponsoring this vlog. Get 20% off your first month by going to ritual.com slash Kinsey20. The code is Kinsey20, so I will have that linked below. Hope you guys enjoyed. Love you guys so much, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye. It doesn't scare me because I chose this, but like... It is interesting when you have so much wrapped up into your career that's not just how you make your money. No, it does scare me. Yeah. It's also like, but I more so just get so annoyed of myself.